Hey everyone, my name is Will. I am a private music teacher. I teach piano, flute, euphonium, voice, uh, music theory, ear training, and all that fun stuff. Um, I have been answering frequently asked questions this month. I know I did one on Tuesday, but I decided I'll do an extra one this week. Um, so my third most frequently asked question it, questions is, why should I take online lessons when I can just watch instructional videos? I personally feel that the answer is 100% right in your face. I don't see how you could miss this answer, but since that is a frequently asked question, and I'm honest, I think I get that from about 70% 70, 70 of students, um, and most of the time people who are asking that question um, don't really know anything about music lessons ahead of time. So let me answer it as straightforward as possible. <clears throat> Why should you take music lessons online instead of just watching tutorial videos and trying to learn that way? Well, the answer is really simple. Do you want someone to help you learn music? To give you instruction about what you are doing wrong and how you can be better? Or do you want to go off of a video and just assume you're doing it correctly? So that's where I think people seem to miss the, the connection here. They're constantly saying, you know, I can watch so-and-so um, they make YouTube videos. They have videos on their website. This guy's a doctor in music. He's an amazing piano player. I'm going to follow his instructional videos. And I'm not saying that that's a bad thing. Um, I'm actually about to embark on a journey to do Teachable, which is a place where you would buy online lessons. Um, but here's the thing. I know that I will be able to put out the lesson but because I'm not interacting directly with that person, if there's something they're not understanding, if there's something they're having a hard time with, um, which I guess is the same thing in a different way, <laughs> sorry. Um, if there's something they don't know they're doing wrong, or if there's something they're doing well, but they could do it better by doing the next thing, I won't be there to tell them that. And that's really the benefit of online lessons. Online lessons will be in your home on your time. So, you know, you just flip on your computer, your iPad, your phone, whatever it is you're taking your lesson on, um, wherever you feel comfortable to take that lesson. And then you interact with me or the teacher one-on-one. -on -one. It's just like being on a video call with your family or your friends. Um, the only difference is there's a purpose in that we are trying to teach you how to you know, sound your best, do your best, things like that. Um, I've heard people say, well, with the amount of um, amount of things that can go wrong between, you know, how my mic takes in my sound versus how you hear the sound as it's transmitted online uh, could cause an issue. I have to agree. Um, that does cause a small problem, but you'd have the exact same problem with taking a course online instead of taking a lesson online. Um, so again, you know, if you're really serious about taking lessons, it comes down to this. If you have never taken lessons before, you should take a lesson online. The lesson will help you get started. Even if you don't take a long period of lessons, even, let's say you take five lessons um, and then you move on, it ends up being better for you for whatever reason to do the, tutor the tutorials you're seeing online or buying the video series you might find on teachable.com or you know uh, going to some music professor's website and watching his videos or her videos. Sorry, <laughs> that's fine. Um, but if you don't already have that foundation, you don't already have somebody there with a musical ear telling you that doesn't sound right, you need to do this, or somebody with experience saying, I've done what you've done. If you do this, you'll get to that point B much faster than if you do all these tiny little steps. In fact, these little things you're doing in between won't help you at all. Um, you just need that foundation. And again, I use the term musical ear. The reason being is there are plenty of people out there that'll tell you you don't sound good or something sounds wrong, but that's only helpful if they can tell you what doesn't sound good, what sounds wrong, why does it sound wrong, how do we make it sound better? So, frequently asked question, why are, should I take online lessons instead of taking a tutorial? Answer, you should take it because you actually get the instruction tailored to you so that you can perform your best, you will learn your fastest, and you will get the most out of lessons that way. All right, guys, I will see you again later. I hope you have a great day. Make sure to like and subscribe. If you have questions, put them in that comment section. Thanks. Bye.